Some of our readers complained of mobile data not working on their new Galaxy S20. The problem reportedly started after a minor update. Such an issue can be pretty annoying especially if your mobile badly needs an internet connection. In this video I will show you how to fix Galaxy S20 mobile data not working. First solution, force restart your phone. Before doing any troubleshooting procedure make sure to refresh your phone's memory and reload all services. You can do so by doing the force restart or the simulated battery removal. Here's how, press and hold the volume down and power keys for 10 seconds. The device will turn off and power back on. When the S20 logo shows release both keys and wait until the reboot is finished. After this, make sure that mobile data is enabled and try to connect to the internet. Second solution reset the network settings. If the first solution failed to make mobile data on your Galaxy S20 work again, then what you have to do next is to reset its network services. Of course, there are other minor troubleshooting procedures you can try but believe me this procedure covers every network or connectivity related issue. Here's how you do it. First, swipe down from the top of the screen and then tap the settings icon. Find and tap general management. Tap reset. Tap Reset Network Settings. Tap the Reset Settings button. However, if the issue is still happening on your phone then proceed to the next step. Third solution, call your service provider. If the first two solutions fail to fix the problem and you still can't connect to the internet by a mobile data then make sure your phone has good signal reception and has enough credits. After making sure that the problem isn't with your phone call your service provider as it's clear at this point that the issue can be with your account or the network. Your provider will advise you what to do if there's an issue with your account or if there's a network problem. There are times when you also have to reset your phone to make sure it's not just due to a minor firmware issue but you have to do that after calling your service provider. If they say your account is still in good standing and that there's no problem with the network then back up your important files and data and do a reset on your phone. That's it hope that this simple tutorial has been helpful. Please support us by subscribing to our channel and enabling notifications. Thanks for watching.